Riley Reed, and uh, I've got the Black Brothers with me today. How are you guys doing? Good. 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 Great. You guys sounded awesome. Thank you for letting me invade your home for this uh, You're welcome. This, this, this rehearsal. You guys are rehearsing for a show coming up, right? Yep, we're playing this Sunday, May 6th, at the Camel. Cool, cool. And, and uh, uh, also playing is uh, Space Monster from Richmond, Natalie Prass from Nashville, Shiloh from Richmond, and Boxer. From awesome. Richmond. They're all really great bands. Awesome, awesome. I'm definitely going to check that out. And uh, so, Justin, you and Parker are brothers, right? You are the Black Brothers, right? Right. Yep. And so, you, did you guys start the band? Um, were you in a band before? How did the, how did it come around? Um, yeah, we were in a band before for a long time, um, and then we kind of had some creative differences, and mm. we decided that the reason we really enjoy playing music is playing together. Yeah. Um, and that's sort of like how we bond is through our music and art. Yeah. And so we were thinking thinking of names for a long time, and then we were just uh, just kind of wanted something that was honest and straight up. Yeah. Um, so we went with our last name. Yeah. What I like about band names is sometimes you know they're either like really really out there, mm -hmm. you know like. My turtleneck sweater, or then there's just like sometimes <laughs> there's just like the black brothers. So. Damn it! Why weren't we my turtleneck sweater? <laughs> I always said if I were to ever create a band, that would be my name. <laughs> band? I don't know why, but uh, no. So that's really cool that you guys started that. I, I love your sound. You guys are very chill guys, as I can see. You're chilling in Churchill. Yeah. yeah. And, chill uh, hill. Chill yeah, hill. chill hill. Chill Hill, like Chill Hill Media, Justin, you worked there too, right? Yeah, I remember yeah. Chill Hill Media for my first show? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> no, cool. Um, so who are some of your, inspir uh, you know, not inspirations, but uh, influences? Um, I guess for me and Parker, we both really like Johnny Cash. Um, his the man in black. kind of how, how appropriate, the man in black for the Black Brothers. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Definitely. And I try to wear all black as much as I can. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing today? Clearly. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, any other influences? With I mean, I think we all kind of have our own mm -hmm. sources of inspiration and influence. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I come from a jazz background, yeah. but also, you know, you know, indie rock and metal kind of all come together. So I mean, you're cool. rocking it on the trumpet. I saw Cake a while, uh, a couple of weeks ago, and they got a trumpet player too. Yeah. yeah, it's cool being able to like, you know, really blend different styles. Yeah. 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 I think as far as a band though, we don't have uh, any other bands that we want. We should something like that. Yeah. I feel like, per personally, I feel like that's not a proper way to start a band or play music. Yeah. yeah obviously, you want to have be. references and influences from other types of music. Right. But. In that sense, you're just kind of copying, yeah. making very contrived music. Yeah, it's less yeah. genuine if you're just trying to be like somebody else. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Genuine, I like that. Like the rap, like the rap. Uh, yes. Yes. Actually, we are trying to be like genuine. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> genuine. 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 All right. Southern hip hop. So, do you guys have like a pre-show ritual or anything that you guys do, you know, beforehand? Uh, we do like this Gregorian chant. Uh, really? Where we all close our eyes and. And basically, like meditate. The way that we yeah. usually rehearse is that uh, we'll set up all our instruments and then we'll just drop them on the floor and then look at them. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's it's usually awesome. how we prepare for a show. Yeah, <laughs> we're, we're a decon band. <laughs> I don't drop mine because. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, cool. And Guys, I can't drop mine because it's <laughs> connected to the floor. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, that's. Uh, very pretty drum set. Yeah, it's pretty much just Tyler that drops his <laughs> yeah. string bass. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Dude. Yeah. It's actually why it's a three string bass. Oh yeah. Okay. It's yeah. One of the, one of the too much too much preparation one practice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. How, how's that playing on a three a three string bass? Uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, you don't really, in my personal opinion, you don't need the four string because I mean you you just end up replicating the same notes at different parts of the fretboard. But uh, it's a lot of fun to kind of work with the constriction of playing a three-string bass. So. Cool, cool. A little music theory lesson for us with the fretboard. I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> no, but hey, guys, thank you so much for having me here today, having That's What's Up. Um, you guys yeah. were awesome. Definitely check them out at the Camel this weekend, uh, along with four other bands, right? Yep. 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 Uh, Three and, and we've got, uh, can, can you tell them for me? Because it's a lot. 
and the band. Yeah, the band. Um, yeah, opening up Space Monster, Natalie Prass, um, Boxer, and Shiloh. All right. And us. Cool, cool. So remember to check them out at the Camel this weekend. That's Sunday, May 6th. Check them out at the Camel. It's going to be a great show. I'm going to be there. You should too. I'm starts at 9. Oh, yeah, it starts at 9. All right, cool. Yeah, it's $5. Five dollars. $5. Yeah. That's cheap. Come on, y'all. You got to go. <laughs> All right. I'm Riley Reed, and that's what's up.